I will be um doing the um it's funny to me how I've been just talking before I turned on the camera and then the light keep flicking. I'm like, God, I know that's you. But I've just been thinking for a while now. In my life like a movie, I got plenty of memories. I help people out with advice and, you know, stuff like that. You know, you already know. I ain't got to get all into it. But, yeah, so today I decided to talk about... <laughs> no, not, let me just fast forward. Boom. So, with that being said, I will be getting on here doing story time here and there. But yeah, so let me do a little story time. And yes, I smoke. You got a problem with that? Fight your mama. Fight my daddy. Up up. But yeah. So yeah. Dude, my acne, sometimes, dude, since I turned off the fan, it's finna get hot. I can feel it now. I can see it. Skin finna get super hot. But yeah. And comment down below something I can use. Like, my skin so sensitive. It's so sensitive. Like, all my body's sensitive. Even with the stuff I gotta, you know, get clean with but yeah so today i decided to talk about how everybody always said i was grown not grown but you give it on me look grown so at this particular this particular story that i'm talking about i was like 15 years old happened a while back <laughs> and um so boom i don't really know where i was coming from but i know for sure like this was around the time like it get dark early like y'all know when it get dark early five six whatever so I was on my way to my grandmother's house, and um, let me just tell y'all how these men chased me down the street. Like, and for one, like I always had a nice looking body. Like I always looked like a grown person to other people. To me, I looked like a child. But to other people, to society, I guess it was the body and the face. Cause everybody always told me that, like she looked grown. Is that the oldest child? Is that the mama? Whole time I was the youngest. So yeah. So let me just get into this story. Let me make it real detailed. So. Why the fuck I'm this age? Boom. <laughs> and I'm walking down the street or whatever. And y'all know how people be trying to talk to y'all. But y'all act like y'all don't see them. And all this and that. So I act like I didn't see him. Them. So I'm still walking and walking. I do that because what is y'all in my face for? And, I, and, and one of my pet peeves is don't beep at me. I don't know who. No. I really don't like them. So boom. Back to the story. So I don't know if these mans was, um, I don't know what they was on, but they kept trying to talk to me, kept trying to talk to me, I steady walking, steady walking. So as I'm walking across the street, and luckily, thank God, I was by my grandmother's house, so I'm walking across the street or whatever, and, um, to get to her house, because her house was right across the street, I had to run through the alley though, so I'm walking across, no, I'm walking, then I'm from across the street, so I'm walking, all I hear is foot, boom, 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 like, behind me, girl, you know you gotta get up out of the like, So y'all know y'all hear somebody, first of all, when you see somebody running on you, but like, be real, you're going to run too. But not only that, you running behind me and I don't want to talk to you. Did you not understand that? But yeah, so as I'm running or whatever, they running behind me or whatever, I'm like, grandma, grandma, <laughs> trying to get up in the house or whatever. I'm banging on the door, but luckily how her, how her, uh, how her house was, it was like a little, it was like an alley you can go three ways. Kind of weird, but yeah, so, um, and she had, like, a drive through but you gotta go up the hill. Like, it was a drive through hill. Like, you rolled up, if you feel what I'm saying. So, yeah. Whole time. Girl, I just got lost in the sauce. Whole time I banging on the door, like, Grandma, Grandma, hiding behind the thing. Because it was, like, a shelf of stairs. Like, they upstairs is, like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, the, it was just so weird. But yeah, it was stairs in front of me, like, and then behind the door, well, the stairs in front of me was, like, the stairs to get, girl, this is so hard to describe, man. So, babe, boom, it's the alley, boom. Then you go, like, say you finna go, y'all know them complexes that be so weird. It was some stairs right here. And then in the back of the stairs, like, you know, the back of the people's stairs, like, in the house or outside or whatever, it was her door. So, I banged on the door and I hid, like, under the bottom, under the stair part. I said, Grandma! Boom! I hear them in the alley tomorrow. Like, Where's she at? Where's she go? Where's she go? Where's she go? The first thing I thought about, like, shit, y'all trying to snatch me? Y'all trying to do something to me? Because if I said no, and not only did I say no, I kept walking. So you know what that means? That's a no automatic. <laughs> but yeah, so she's like, what, 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 who is that? Who am I though? I said the name. I walk, I ran in the house. Boom. So tell me some told me to look outside. I turned off all the lights. I looked outside. They right there. I'm like, that was nothing but God. That was nothing but God. The suits is on because you want to get in there because I'm gonna fight for mine and I'm gonna run for mine. You feel what I'm saying? So, yeah, 
So yeah, so the whole time I'm just sitting there like, dang. <laughs> I'm like, dang, what the fuck was they really trying to do? And I was real scared, but at the same time I wasn't too frantic because it's like, I knew God always had me. I already know that. But I'm not going to sit and lie like I wasn't scared because I was scared. And that's probably why I'm terrified of men now because they, they always were so weird. Like, get off me. And I know how I'm going to be about my kids. I don't play that. I don't care how grown they look. <laughs> play with yours, not mine. You better play with somebody because it ain't that. But, yeah, so, um. But, yeah, more of the story. I'm looking outside. I'm looking outside. They're like, where'd she go? Where'd she go? And all this and that. Whole time I was hidden behind the stairs. And y'all was out there and couldn't find me. Couldn't see me. That was nothing but God. Because that's like a little mystery spot. But at the same time, if you got common sense, you would look... You know what I'm saying? Like, if you coming down, like, say we're playing hide and seek and you got a stair like that, and that's a hiding spot. That's common sense. But it wasn't common sense for a slow person. But you get what I'm saying? Like, God, he nothing but good. My father is good. Period, point blank. But yeah, I said that to say, like, people just be weird and, and they feel like you just, you look grown, so you grown or whatever. And people just look at their body and whatever, so they feel like you grown. Like, no. But more of the story, this story time is really about how God saved me from two men. Period. Point blank. And that's what I'm going to name the title. And y'all need to tune in. I should do another story time because I just feel like I just need to talk to y'all. But yeah, so I'm going to upload this. Like I said, only the real know. Only the real recognize. The real. So I ain't got to tell y'all what to do. Y'all should know what to do. Stay tuned. Tune in. Tune in. Tune in. Tune in.